This video explains the basics of conic sections. Conic sections are defined as the curve obtained when sectioning of a cone by cutting planes at different angles. Different curves obtained are circle, ellipse, parabola and hyperbola. Various components of a cone are vertex or apex point. It is a tip of the cone. Axis. It is an imaginary line passing through the apex point and center point of the base. Generator. It is a line passing through the apex point and any point on the boundary of the base. Base. It is the bottom circular surface of the cone. A circular shape will be obtained when the cutting plane is perpendicular to the axis of the cone or parallel to the base of the cone. An elliptical shape will be obtained when the cutting plane is inclined to the axis of the cone and passes through the generators. A parabolic shape will be obtained when the inclined cutting plane passes through the base. A hyperbolic shape will be obtained when the cutting plane, inclined cutting plane passes through the base but not passing through the axis of the cone. Conics. Conics is defined as the locus of a point moving in such a way that the ratio of its distances from a fixed point and from a fixed straight line is always a constant. The fixed point is known as focus. The fixed straight line is called directrix. The horizontal line drawn perpendicular to the directrix is called axis. And the point of intersection between the locus and the axis is called vertex. The ratio of distances is called eccentricity ratio. For an ellipse, this eccentricity ratio is always less than 1. For parabola, eccentricity ratio is equal to 1. And for hyperbola, eccentricity ratio is always greater than 1. 